The third and last category of the asset management clause is called media handling, and is concerned with security issues related to stored information. The first control is management of removable media. This control discusses the risks and the necessary measures to deal with them, in relation to using removable media in an organization. It discusses those matters on organizational and personnel levels. On a personnel level, if there is no serious business need for employees using removable media, then it should not be allowed. There is really no easier way to get an organization's data leaked. Another concern is introducing malware into your environment carried on removable media drives. If the conditions necessitate, then many measures should be in place. A record of who is allowed to use removable media should be maintained, and what data they have transferred to those devices. Monitoring of transfer activities should be managed. Removable media should be constantly scanned as well to ensure that they are not infected. The physical safety of those media devices should be tightly guarded, since they usually come in small sizes and can be easily misplaced. On an organizational level, the main use of removable media is for backup purposes or transfer of critical information. This is normally performed by specialized information technology staff. Removable media should be stored in safe locations, and under the manufacturer's recommended environmental conditions. Locations that are prone to heat and humidity should normally be avoided. If critical information is stored on removable media, then the media should be constantly maintained, to ensure that the data won't be lost. In case the media's quality is being degraded, the data should be transferred to new media. Once the removable media is not required anymore, the data should be properly cleaned and made impossible to recover. Proper disposal procedures should be in place, depending on the media type. To ensure that stored critical data remains safe and secure, even if the media has been compromised, cryptographic techniques and encryption methods should be used. For business continuity reasons, multiple copies of critical data should be maintained, and preferably in safe distant locations, to avoid any disaster risks.